what's up there in this video i'm gonna show you something really 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 cool you're gonna love you are gonna learn how to create this brick wall here just using the mesh editor tools available in 4.26 we're going to destroy the big brick wall inside unreal no need to go outside the editor no need any other tool everything is inside unreal so let's get started First I have this wall here and I have some UVs on it and I apply a material you will see that I can see my brick wall and what I want to do is just destroy this and normally what you will do is to cut this in a 3D modeling application and then you know cut it through, delete, close up holes it's really a pain, it's really a pain and now we can do it in Unreal. All right, so I will show you. First, let's click outside here and let's go to modeling. Inside modeling, I'm going to create a path. I'm going to create a polygon. First, I need to make sure I can see my gizmo here. I can see it here. Let's move it here close to our brick wall and I will rotate it. If I hold shift if I hold shift I will rotate it like this so this is my gizmo and now I'm gonna make sure I'm in the right perspective mode so here you can choose left and you can see I can see my brick wall now and I'm not in perspective view and the cool thing about it is that if I press F2, normally you will see something like this, but you can actually change the type of rendering you have so you can see the lead mode or then lead. So now we want to destroy this wall. It's very easy. We just need to follow, create a path and follow it just like this. All right, so we start like this, go like this, maybe something like this. Maybe create something here. You can see how this one you can easily create something with a nice silhouette. Like a really nice destroyed wall here. And then maybe I can go like here, here. A little bit mess up there. All right, almost done, almost done. All right, and then go here and let's close it. And then complete. Whoop, I cannot see it. I cannot see it. Let's do it again, let's do it again. Go to polygon. Oh, what happened here? Looks like I cannot see it here. Is it here? I'm not really sure. So let's let's do it again. Let's do it again. Let's try something like this first. See if it works. Okay. Maybe maybe I can just create instead of interactive a screw to height. And this one will choose my height here. Just choose this value here. So let's try again. Let's go to this mode, delete this one. Let's go to my mode, modeling. And here, let's see. It's completely experimental tools, but I'm sure we can do the work. Polygon, grab our gizmo, rotate it, holding shift, 90 degrees. And now let's go to left view and start cutting here. Just like this. There you go, here, here. Hop. We really want to have a nice silhouette here. Maybe you can go far. Do you need this a little bit faster? And it looks like it's a snapping to some grid. There might be some options to quit the snapping. You can be more precise with this. So, 
Let's use like this and then just go back here. Here, just like this. Then go here, 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 and then complete. And there you go. And now, if we go to perspective, this is our mesh. We're gonna put it here. Click this one, click this one, and click on Mesh Boolean. And bam! Now you have your destroyed brick wall. A little bit strange here, but a really cool thing about this is that it really preserves the, the UVs you still have. So if I click this one and then go here and then go mesh boolea, there you go. Click accept and now have another wall. Let's check. This is my generated wall. I can rotate it, scale it, minus one. There you go. Really cool. Really cool stuff. And you can move it here, something. Something like this. And there you go. That's that's your broken brick wall. All inside Unreal. This is a really quick tip. I wanted to take a break from making this one. And this is really nice actually. And it creates the geometry here. You can optimize it a little bit if you want. Like if you go to, I guess it's triangles. Simplify. There you go. Accept. And now you have a more simplified mesh. You can do that if you want. Or you can modify the UVs later on. And also it will create another material. So I can easily put this brick wall here. Or I can put another rock material or something like that. Like let's see if I have something here. No. No I don't. So I can put another material here. And it will look super super nice so the way i discovered this i was just watching some videos from a guy from epic he has a really nice channel where he goes in depth and it's cool it's cool that we can generate these things inside unreal and you know it's all about thinking about what you can do with these tools some people say that you can model something could sale is useless I say it has potential, it's not there yet, but you still can do a lot of things like this. And I think this is a very creative way to easily, like less than one minute, create a brick wall like this. So, if you like this video, click the subscribe button, give me one of these, and let me know in the comments what kind of video you want to see next. If you want some free resources, click the link below, you can get some free resources in your game development journey, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.